Welcome to the Autoimmune Tipping Point. I'm Josie Warren, the Autoimmune Expert. And before we get started, I want you to sign up for my free master course. The link is in the description below. In this master course, you are going to learn why you got lupus, why everything you've been doing has not worked to resolve it, why unfortunately your doctors and specialists have lupus all wrong, and most importantly, you are going to learn how to permanently resolve lupus just like I have and go back to being a normal, healthy person again without supplements, medication, or food protocols. Now, today we are diving into lupus and exploring the five main symptoms. And I want you to know, I understand what it's like to have lupus. And the hardest part for me with lupus was really knowing that I had it. The symptoms that I had, like chest pain, inflammation throughout my body, headaches, I didn't equate those with lupus. I thought that those were signs and symptoms of the other autoimmune diseases that I had. And since I didn't have that lupus butterfly rash on my face, it went undiagnosed for years. In retrospect, it is now so clear that I had lupus. And I want you to know that I'm eight years completely resolved of lupus. I no longer have it or any of my other autoimmune diseases. And in the end of this video, I'm going to share with you exactly what I did to resolve it, which is exactly what you can do too, and really what this channel is all about. So let's dive into lupus. And what is lupus? Lupus is an autoimmune disease. And that's really important to take note of because that's going to come into play in a big way at the end when I talk about how to resolve it. And an autoimmune disease is a condition in which our body's immune system becomes dysregulated, mistakenly attacking the very tissues and organs it was designed to protect. In the case of lupus, what's happening is that your overactive immune system attacking those tissues and organs is causing, and get this, widespread inflammation throughout your body. Inflammation is a huge symptom of lupus. And that inflammation is affecting parts of your body, such as your lungs, your skin, your heart, your brain, your kidneys, and even circulating blood cells. Now, according to the Lupus Foundation of America, 1.5 million Americans have lupus. And of those, 90% are women. They also go on to say that one in three people with lupus also suffer from multiple autoimmune diseases. And this is what happened with me. Lupus was not the only autoimmune disease that I had. And that can be a problem because it can be very hard to diagnose lupus. And let's go into why. Lupus shares many of the same similarities to other illnesses, which is why doctors call lupus the great imitator. And according to the Lupus Foundation of America, and this is really shocking to me, It takes people on average six years of having lupus before they get that lupus diagnosis. And in that time, two out of three people receive an incorrect diagnosis and have to see on average three healthcare practitioners to finally get that accurate diagnosis of lupus. Now, let's go into those five main symptoms of lupus. And number one, not surprising, inflammation and also swelling in places like the hands, the feet, the legs, and also around the eyes. Now, number two is rashes, in particular with lupus, that butterfly rash that covers the bridge of the nose and goes on both cheeks. Number three, headaches. Number four, chest pain. And number five, pain and swelling in the joints. Now, with 1.5 million Americans having lupus, you would think that doctors and specialists would really be dialed in and knowing what causes lupus. Where is it really coming from? But listen to this. According to the National Institute of Health, they say the cause of lupus is unknown. And researchers are still trying to learn what may trigger or lead to the disease. They go on to say doctors know that it is, and this is important, a complex autoimmune disease in which the body's immune system attacks the person's tissues and organs. And so what they're saying here is that our doctors, researchers, and scientists do not currently know what causes lupus. And that's incredibly problematic because if they don't know what causes it, how can they actually know how to resolve it? Now, 
I'm going to share with you the real cause of lupus in just a moment, and that's going to teach us how to resolve it. But before that, if you are getting value from this video, like this video, subscribe to my channel, and most importantly, share this video with your loved ones who have lupus, your friends, your family, your coworkers. I am here to share a different pathway and to let them know they too can resolve lupus just like I have. And again, I'll be sharing how to do that next. And so let's go into the real cause of lupus. And it comes back to lupus being an autoimmune disease. Now listen up here. All autoimmune diseases have the same origin. They have the exact same root cause. So whether one has lupus or Hashimoto's or fibromyalgia or celiac or one of the 92 autoimmune diseases, again, they're all coming from the same place, that dysregulated and overactive immune system. That is the cause of lupus. When you resolve your immune system, regulate it, get it going back to normal functioning, you resolve lupus and all symptoms. Now, what that is also telling us is what is not causing lupus. And there's a lot of misinformation out there. Lupus is not coming from the Epstein-Barr virus. It's not coming from your genetics or toxins, foods, bacteria, antigens, pathogens. The sole cause of lupus, overactive immune system. Again, resolve that, resolve lupus. And here's the thing though. There is no medication, supplement, or food protocol that will regulate your immune system and resolve lupus. So what I'm saying is that all medications, supplements, and food protocols are symptom management, working on the symptoms, not the true cause of lupus. And you can never resolve lupus working with symptom management. I wish someone would have told me that earlier. And in my free master course, I dive into the harsh truth of symptom management and explain why everything you've been doing has not worked to resolve lupus. Now, Let's go into the solution. How do you regulate your immune system, permanently resolving lupus in all of your symptoms without supplements, medication, or food protocols? And listen up because no one is sharing this. It all starts with suppressed emotional stress. Your suppressed emotional stress is actually what has weakened your immune system. And this was the same for me. Over time, your suppressed emotional stress got your body stuck in the sympathetic nervous system and locked in fight or flight. And that's really important to know because it's here stuck in fight or flight, which is where you are currently having lupus, that your body's immune system became dysregulated, started attacking your tissues and organs, creating that widespread infl inflammation and resulting in lupus. And so... To permanently resolve lupus, all you need to do, turn off your fight or flight mechanism. That is exactly what I have done. When you turn off fight or flight, your body can finally exit the sympathetic nervous system where it is now and move back into the parasympathetic nervous system and back into its adaptive state of homeostasis. Back in homeostasis, your dysregulated immune system regulates again naturally and stops attacking your tissues and organs. And just like that, lupus is resolved as are the symptoms of that pain, swelling, inflammation, chest, headaches, rashes. They all resolve simply by turning off fight or flight. So that is the key. That's what I've done to resolve lupus. What you can do turn off your fight or flight mechanism. It's that simple. And to learn how to turn off your fight or flight mechanism, watch my free master course link in the description here below. In this master course, you're going to learn the answers to questions no one is telling you. Number one, why you develop lupus. Number two, why everything you've been doing has not worked. Number three, why your doctors and specialists unfortunately have lupus all wrong. And most importantly, you will learn exactly how to turn off your fight or flight mechanism, move from the sympathetic to the parasympathetic, and naturally resolve lupus and all of your symptoms with without medication, without supplements, and without food protocols. I am passionate about sharing another pathway. You do not have to have the autoimmune disease of lupus for the rest of your life. You can heal and self-repair and get yourself and your life back.
This is what I have done. And this is what the autoimmune tipping point is all about. I am so glad that you're here.